Google has done it again. They have taken control of something that they think is actually helping people when it's actually costing them and wasting them a ton of money. Let's get started. Hi, my name is Mike Mancini. I'm a Google Ads agency owner for the last 11 years. Google has rolled out automatically created assets inside of your Google Ads campaign. Now, this is nothing new. This is something they've been doing for quite some time. However, at the account level, you can go in and turn these off. Now, typically we will only go in and review these assets every 30, 60, 90 days, depending on how much the campaign is spending. However, we have noticed a significant decrease in the performance of a lot of our campaigns over the last couple of months. So we've tried to dig deeper and deeper and deeper to see what's going on. What we have found out is even though we have turned off automatically created assets, Google is still applying them to our account. Now I want to jump in. I want to show you exactly what it is and how to turn it off. But most importantly, show you just how much money it has cost these campaigns. And it's absolutely insane. All right. So here we are inside of a campaign and we're looking back the last 30 days. But I want you to look at all of these automatically created assets. Well, one thing that we do when we start a brand new campaign is we go into the settings. So at the top level of Google, you will go into settings and then click account settings. As you can see, auto apply turned off. We automatically turn this off when we create any new campaign. We want control over this because of exactly what I'm going to show you right now. So in this campaign, you can see all of these automatically created assets. Look at how many clicks it's had. Look at how much these average costs per click because this is a very competitive industry. With that said, it has spent under site links that they've automatically created $1,600. Why is this so important? Look at the site links. So you can see all of these that we have paused, but what they keep doing is they keep creating them even though we have them turned off. And here's what they're doing. They're saying find testimonials. If you hover over this, it's going to a landing page that we created. The problem is it's going three quarters of the way down the page. Here's at the top of the page. It's going right to this part of the page. No one is going to convert. They're just going to click the back button because all they see loading is Google reviews and not the information they're looking for. Here's the worst part. As you can see, all of these ones are paused. We have gone in and paused all of them again last Friday, four days ago. Now let's go back and look. And since we have paused them, they have added four more site links and it's cost us over $100, $106.09. Google is taking liberty with these campaigns and just turning these things back on. We have set it to not include these assets. We have turned them off. We have paused. In other campaigns, we have removed them and they just keep adding them as fast as we can turn them off. And they've hidden the way to turn it off. I'm gonna show you how to turn them off right now. Inside your assets, go to the more button, account level automated assets. If there's any options here, make sure you turn them off. You're gonna might see a different screen. But what you need to do here is go to more advanced settings. As you can see, look at all of these. And since last week, these two have popped up, dynamic business names and dynamic business logos. We are not giving Google any more control over these campaigns. So site links, off. Select a reason, concerned about performance, save. Dynamic callouts, off. Concerned about performance, save. And go through and do that for all of these. This is the problem where it's getting harder and harder and harder to give clients great results using Google ads when they continue to do these types of things. They did not announce this. We literally found this setting in the last four days. When I was in this account four days ago, this setting was not in there. So they keep changing this stuff. They keep turning on these assets, which is driving traffic to a place we don't want it to go and it's costing our campaigns and our clients money. So go into all your campaigns right now, all of your accounts, make sure all of these are paused, the things that you do not want, these automatically created assets. If you want them in there, make sure they're at least driving traffic to the right place, but go through and make sure you start saving your campaigns money 
today. Because if you don't, I promise you over the next couple of days, it's going to continue to spend that money. And if you don't turn them off at this level, they will add them literally overnight. As you can see, I apologize. I'm a little bit worked up by this because we thought we had the problem solved and then they keep turning these things on and not telling us how to turn it off. We literally had to figure it out ourselves. So I hope that helps you make the right changes to help your Google Ads campaign. And please, in the comment section below, if this has happened to you, let us know. Let others know so they can also go through and make these changes. And if you got some value, please do me a favor, hit that like button. It really does help us in the eyes of YouTube. And if you wanna see some more related videos over to the right-hand side, you will see some of those. Thank you so very much. I do always greatly appreciate it and we'll see you next time.